In this lesson, we'll begin installing our Linux distribution. We're going to need two things, VirtualBox and the Ubuntu disk image. I'm using VirtualBox because it's simpler if you want to try out Linux first, and then if you're seriously committed, then you can install Linux directly onto your computer. The main difference between one and the other is that you actually need to run a CD and burn it with the image. Then you just pop the CD into your CD tray and then restart the computer. The CD will be recognized and the Linux installer will be presented to you on the screen. Since we're going to use VirtualBox, I'm going to pop up the browser really quick and type in virtualbox.org. Here you can access the very latest version of VirtualBox. If you're using OS 10, which is unlikely, then click this link. Or if you're using Windows, which is most likely, then click this link. I already have it installed, so I don't need to download anything. The next step is to go to ubuntu.com, since this is the distribution we're going to use. Go to download and check desktop. You have two versions here at the bottom, one that's the long-term support and the latest version of October 2013. Choose this one. It is the latest one. If you're going to install on your machine directly into your hard drive, then select 64-bit. We're going to be using VirtualBox, so I'm going to select the bottom one. Let's click on the distribution and scroll directly to the download since we don't want to donate anything just yet. Okay. The ISO image will be downloaded. It's a pretty big file, so we can just wait a little longer. It's going to take at least 20 minutes, so let me just jump in to the VirtualBox configuration screen.